I'm Emily Gordon. And I'm Kamel Nanjiani. And you're watching New You. I thought we were going to do that together. <laughs> New You. I was late. Well, first of all, congratulations. Very Thank exciting. Thank you. Uh, it's really lovely. I think the, the biggest thing, the most important thing about it, I mean, everyone loves to get honored for something, but I, the idea that this raises awareness and that part of our movie coming out is us helping to raise awareness for a larger cause that's affecting a lot of people, I think is the most important thing. So I'm really, really, I'm excited for the award, but I'm more excited for awareness raising. Yeah, and I agree. I mean, you know, it's a, it's a, uh, it's a, condition and a group of conditions that are very, very hard to diagnose. Um, and so the more awareness we have for it, I think the, the quicker these diagnoses can be. And your film has been, I mean, it's amazing, the reception it's received, the award buzz. How are you handling all of this? Barely. Yeah. We're doing okay. We're maybe, we're maybe eating pastries more than we have. <laughs> Uh, a little stress eating. It's, it's overwhelming and lovely, and I think it's one of those things that feels so big it's hard to kind of process, like a lot of things in life. And so you just try to take it in small chunks and do your best to remind yourself to be in the moment uh, and kind of enjoy or feel whatever you're feeling in the moment and not think too much about what's coming in the past and ahead. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, well, for a long time it was sort of nerve-wracking, you know. It's like, I hope people see the movie. I hope it gets good reviews. We were working on the movie up until... So it was a lot of work, and now I think... We're actually having fun with it. Mm -hmm. It's it's fun yeah, having it out there. Yeah, yeah, having a good time. Do you have advice to people who are struggling with illnesses out there and, and caretakers, family members, having been through such you know you know experience like that? Uh, as a person who has been through it, I would say uh, to realize that you're not alone. I think for a long time I felt like it almost felt like a weird, sh shameful secret is not exactly the right, but a, a cousin of that. Like I felt like oh this is my business. I don't need to like I don't want to bother other people with my stuff, but you'd be surprised and amazed at how many people are going through similar things and you're not alone. And uh, I wish I'd known that earlier. It kind of took the movie coming out for me to really learn that lesson, unfortunately. Uh, and if I could give that advice, you're not alone. And so don't feel ashamed and don't feel weird and don't hate yourself for what your body does, uh, but kind of accept and, and realize there's a community for you. What about caretakers? No, I mean, that's exactly right. You know, I think for a long time, Emily, it's tough to talk about the ways in which your body has uh, been difficult to deal with, yeah. right? And, and, and as Emily was saying, um, there can be a sense of shame attached to it, but there really shouldn't be. It's not your fault. Um, and so... And I'd say uh, as my caretaker, you're very good at tireless research, which I think... Oh, there we go. Hey. Which, yeah. and, and also sometimes learning that you don't have to be the one to solve it. That you're, you know, that's the Having, thing. Still, still working on that. Still working on that. Yeah. That's true, yeah. Now, lastly, uh, what do you do to stay healthy now? I mean, it, with all this going on, you got to maintain your energy levels. And, I mean, it's exhausting. Yeah, I, I, do, I do a lot of self-care. So I, I kind of watch myself at events, and I don't, I never kind of, uh, I just take care of myself physically at these events. I don't overdo anything. I make sure I'm eating enough. I make sure I'm exercising. I make sure I'm sleeping enough. It's all really boring stuff, but that's part of it. It's like yeah. self-care ultimately is a little boring. Yeah. No, but it's also fun, you know? We try and have days where we're just gonna lay on a couch and watch movies and, and that, we have to build those in and those are really fun. Those are the days we're most excited about. That's true. And do you stay active together, exercising at all? We all? don't work out together. We she both work out. out. We, I work out at home. He works out at the gym. But we have like, at, when it's workout time, we both kind of go and like... At the same time. At the same time. I love that. You have a schedule for it. Yes. Awesome.